Hello everyone, welcome to the Study Hacks Institute of GIS and Remote Sensing. Today I will talk about a new video on Remote Sensing. So basically today I will try to discuss about that how we can easily find out the barrel land in the urban area. So basically it's there a lot of limitation to access the build up and barren land in the urban area. So all time it will be just mix their pixel and we did not get the better map to identify the barren land and urban or build up area. So for this region, today's session, I will show you that how we can easily differentiate between that urban and also barren land. So for that, in this time, I use this paper concept. So here you can see this is the paper, one kind of paper. Basically, this paper worked for a new index. It's called that EBBI mainly enhance buildup and barrenness index. So basically this is the one kind of index. So we can easily use this index and we can easily differentiate the buildup and barren land in an urban area. So just to show you this method, further I will show you that how we can easily work with the Google Earth Engine and then further we can easily work with that. So basically you can see uh, this is the full paper about that. And in this paper, we can easily find out all of algorithm basically what types of algorithm they are working here and how what type of band we have to use to create the ebi mainly enhanced build up and barrenness index to identify the build up and barren land so all of those things you can also easily from this paper okay and you can easily read the full paper then you can get a lot of idea how it will work this type of index basically ebbi index so now I will show you that how it will work in Google Earth Engine. So first of all, here you can see this is my satellite imagery. I already import and satellite imagery for my study area of Dhaka City. So now further from this satellite imagery, I want to extract only for the build up and barren land. I want to differentiate the two feature from the satellite image. One is that a barren land, another is the build up. So for that here you can see I already add this type of layer. So this is my map after Calculate the EBBI index, I can get this type of interface. So basically from this interface, I can easily get this type of result. So here you can see we can uh, get this type of feature. So basically this type of yellow color, it's identify about that your barren land. Okay, so it's identify about the barren land. Okay, so we can easily identify about the barren land. This type of yellow color, identify about the barren land. So now how, how it will work. So it's very easy. So first of all, we are just import our image collection. So in this time, I simply import our land set top of atmospheric image collection. I simply import. And further, I simply put my specific time period about that. And then I just simply calculate the equation. For calculating the EBBI index, I need the two band. One is the short wave infrared one band and near infrared band. And also need the TIR band. I also need basically it is the brightness temperature band. And further, I just simply put this formula. So this is the formula about that. So this is the formula: short wave infrared subtract with near infrared divided by ten and multiply with this type of two band. Okay, just I simply multiply and add the two band and divide it with the ten. Just add this formula. Further, we will just show the result. Then we can get easily get it. So for that, after we getting this type of things, I need to get for that build up and barren land. So I can get easily this type of barren land. So basically positive value, high positive value, it's indicating about that barren land. Okay. And low value, it's indicating about that. It can be vegetation about that or other things or water body about this. So here you can see this is the paper. So from this paper, we also discuss about this method. So here you can see about that spectral profile of all of feature from the satellite imagery. So basically here you can see about that uh, your barren land. So this is the barren land spectral uh, signature profile you can get. And also you can see about that residential or also it's one kind of build up. So here you can see almost we can get that some pixel value is the similar. Okay, you can see it, it, it's the overlay, the build up and barren land is the is um, overlay is other. So that's why for this region, Without this type of EBBI index, uh, without this type of index, we cannot differentiate the parallel and build up area. So normally it just overlay. This type of pixel is the overlay and we cannot get that better result. 
so that's why in this time uh, in this paper they also add the new index about that you can see ebi formula so basically this is the formula about that it's formula for that landsat 7 imagery so you can easily work for the landsat 8 or landsat 9 about that so this is the formula about that so we are in this time we are just use this formula and further we calculate the enhanced build up and barrenness index okay so that's using this index we can easily identify about that build up and barren land area so here you can see about their data so basically in this time they are using the landsat uh, etm plus data so basically this is the landsat 7 about this data they are using here for creating this paper and also you can see about the analysis about that so basically this is the main analysis part from their study on the application of the eb bi for mapping build up and barren land areas mapping that do using this index and further you can see uh, there also use some other index to identify for the other feature but in this time there are main concern about that ebbi index and further you can see about that result so basically in this time also you can see that uh, ebbi index so basically this type of pixel 0 0.1 to 0 0.3 5 it's including about the barren land yeah. and 0 0.35 greater than all of pixel will be considered as a barren land okay so just they are making the some pixel wise classification about that and mapping uh build up and a barren land you can see for that they are put here that so basically they get this type of feature when they are used at the ebbi index they can this type of uh, build up area when they are used at the other index ibi or ndbi they also get this type of uh, area different area they can in here okay so here you can see about that result also same for the barren land okay so when they are used at that ebbi index they can get that 173.79 hectare area when they are used at the uh, ibbi index they can get this type of area okay so basically it is the comparison between the different types of uh, index for identify about that uh, barren land and build up area and they are also calculate the area about these things so also you can see about that about this type of map so basically they are used at the ebi this is the index they can get this type of map also ibi or ndbi so basically there are a the lot of index we are using here so now also check uh, about their uh, transformation about you can see the part sentence accuracy about that so in this time they are find out that the high accuracy it show about that ebbi index okay so ebbi index they are get that high accuracy so that's why they are in this time it's another kind of new index using this index we can easily find out that barren land and build up area also you can see they calculate there about that uh, relationship between that correlation between the build up area and also about things also for this you can see so there's a lot of information easily get from this paper okay so this is the paper enhanced build up and barrenness index for mapping build up and barren land uh, in urban area and basically it's very useful for the urban area to identify for the build up and barren land so in this time i just put this type of formula and also make this type of class so that's we can easily get uh, this type of result so i run the code again so now i can see it this is my study area and this is my satellite imagery from here we can easily apply the ebbi index so this is the formula about that and further we can easily identify about that build up area and barren land area we can easily get so basically this type of things is identify about that barren land okay your local identity about the barren land so basically this is the process to use the enhanced build up and barren land index and we can easily use the index and we can easily identify about that build up and barren land okay so if you like this video simply press the like button and if you have any question you can simply uh, Test in the comment section i also give the answer about that so today is no more and uh, i also give you an announcement for our upcoming online training program so basically uh this online training program this registration is open now and this class will be start from that uh 14 june okay so now this registration is ongoing so this class will be start from the 14 june and last action is the 13 june and first 10 this is will get the 50 percent discount and basically these are totally seven days online training program on google earth engine if we have no knowledge about that uh, coding such as python javascript or any kind of programming language you totally zero knowledge then don't worry about that you learn all of those things from beginners to advanced level so basically this is our time we take this class on this time and each day i will provide you the three hours and basically if you want to join this online training program simply contact in this whatsapp number and also contact with this email so you can check all of course syllabus from the video description 
you can literally get all of things as well as you can also get some benefit when you join this online live training program so you can get the course certificate after submitting all of the assignment you can get that course material mainly slide pdf you can get all of practice code so that's you can easily practice and if you missed any live training session you can easily get the recorded class and you also get the lifetime teaching support so basically uh when you want to learn the google Earth engine platform you face a lot of problems so that's why you need the continuous support so that's why we are also providing the lifetime teaching support so when you face any problem regarding any issue in your code you can easily get the support so you can check all of details for our upcoming online training program this class will be start from the 14th june and if you want to join just simply contact this whatsapp number and also contact with this email so today is no more thank you for watching that stay happy stay safe